Dexcom One has optional alerts to keep you informed throughout the day and night. During setup, you will have turned your alerts on or off. If you turn your alerts on, you can customize these to your personal needs. To customize your alerts or to turn them on or off, tap Settings in the app and then tap Alerts. To customize your low alert, tap Low and choose the level you want to be alerted at. Once done, tap Save. Here you can also choose the sound you want your low alert to make. Tap Tone to pick from a variety of sounds or you can choose Vibrate Only. You can turn on Snooze to get a repeat alert if your sensor reading stays low. You choose how long your snooze time will be. Now let's customize the high alert. Tap High and choose the level you want to be alerted at. Once done, tap Save. In your High Alert menu, you can also customize the tone and snooze for your High Alert. You have the option to delay your first High Alert until your sensor reading is consistently high for the amount of time you choose. For example, the alert will not sound until you have been in your high range for over 30 minutes. Your low alert is the red line on the glucose graph. When you go below your low alert setting, the app alerts you and the circle turns red. Your high alert is the yellow line on the glucose graph. When you go above the high alert setting, the app alerts you and the circle turns yellow. It is important to know how your alert sounds work. Both the high and low alerts follow your phone settings. So, if your phone is on silent or do not disturb, your alerts will be silent. Make sure you always select the correct settings to hear or mute your alerts. Now you know how to customize your alerts for better control of your diabetes.